It has been nine months now since those scenes of unbelievable devastation caused by the earthquake and tsunami in Japan. The waves that destroyed entire towns pulled all that debris back out to sea. And since March, it has been carried by currents across the Pacific, a huge field of floating debris making its way ever closer to the west coast. The first of it may now have begun washing ashore. CTV's Chandler Grieve has the story from Tofino. From the far east of the globe, to the far west of Vancouver Island. Fishermen and friends that have said that they found like unusual amounts of bottles and items with uh, Asian writing on it. Some are speculating that the debris to wash up along the beaches of Tofino over the last week are directly related to last spring's earthquake and tsunami that rocked Japan. Yeah, just sort of more so than usual. We're finding um, bottles and different items from Japan. Island of garbage floating out there, so it's bound to make its way this way at some point in time. and possibly yesterday. These items have all been found over the past week by Jean-Paul. That one is from Japan. There's a couple here from uh, a couple items from China. Experts think that the debris won't arrive to North America until 2013. But Jean-Paul has lived right on Chesterman's Beach his whole life. He owns a local surf shop in Defino and says there is no denying that more garbage and wood is showing up outside his back door. Uh, the first two letters is the country code, so it says JP for Japan. This year we've seen over 50 pieces already, which is really, really uh, extraordinary. And uh, who knows, it could be coming off boats could be, again, from uh, the earthquake in Japan. Now, nobody knows for certain if this lemon all joy air freshener arrived on the coast of Vancouver Island as a result of that earthquake and tsunami that hit Japan last spring. But one thing beachcombers and experts can agree on is that more bottles like this will be arriving on the western coast of Vancouver Island shortly. But either way, you know, whatever it is, whether it is related to this earthquake or not, it's an eye opener as to what's coming for sure. The mayor of Tofino says people will be interested in what washes ashore, but says that debris must be treated with respect. It's definitely there. We, with I would say, without question, we've seen the first evidence uh, coming ashore of the last March's uh, Japan tsunami. Treat the whole thing with some respect, because uh, definitely everything um, that's involved that is coming ashore is dealt with quite a significant human tragedy. For now, beachcombers and surfers will continue with their daily lives, knowing that their playground soon could become a large landfill of garbage, and reminders of just how devastating the Japanese earthquake and tsunami was. Chandler Grieve, CTV News, Tofino.